Hey, welcome back once again to the motherboards.org YouTube channel, people. It's me, Elric Ferris, your host. And today is the launch of the new NVIDIA GTX 560 Ti series of cards. So we knew you'd ask for it. So we've gone ahead and we've tested these cards in SLI mode for you folks. So let's check out how a pair of GTX 560 cards goes in SLI mode. Now, we've used one of the cards, which is a standard reference card that we've got from NVIDIA. We're also using the overclock version that we got from ASUS, but we're gonna set them both to the reference clock speeds for these videos. So let's check this out and see how the new GTX 560 runs in SLI mode. <laughs> So you're a guy who wants maximum video performance. You're a hardcore gamer and you're trying to make a decision. Well, getting into a pair of GTX 560 cards, depending on which ones you're gonna get, is gonna be between $500 and about $559, depending on the manufacturer, brand, and sale price you get. Now, you can see with SLI, with these two cards, we're getting between 50 and 100% increased performance in SLI mode, depending on the application. Now. Price point to price point exactly, we would be comparing a 6870 in Crossfire to this. But actually we're gonna do some more videos and we're gonna compare it to the 6950 as well. But for price point for price point, right now a pair of GTX 560s cost you the same as a pair of AMD 6870s and runs faster. So I'd say for dollar for dollar and comparing if Apple to Apple, if you so will, I would have to choose the two GTX 560s in SLI mode over a pair of 6870s in crossfire mode. So I give the SLI a thumbs up and an editor's choice here on motherboards.org. Thanks for watching.